Hey, nerdlings! What's up, nerdlings? You see the shirts, which means we must be asking, do you nerd for... Trading cards. They're doing things they've never done, hoping that it's lots of fun. Oh, oh, oh they're nerdgins. That is right. Even though we are wearing our video games monthly shirt, there is another monthly little uh, box thing that you can get out there that we had to try out. This is... Trading Cards Monthly! So, uh, it's it's not as big as the video game monthly. But trading cards aren't as big That's as video true. games. They're, they're thin. So let's get in here. Look at that cute little box! That is a very adorable little box. That's so, a little tiny so box. So teeny tiny. Now, uh... I believe that Trading Cards Monthly is essentially the same idea as Video Games Monthly in that they send you packs of trading cards for your collection. Now since there is that factor of randomness in trading cards, I do not believe that there's any kind of list that you can populate to yeah. make sure you don't get duplicates, but that's the whole point of the trading So you can trade cards. them! <laughs> now I do know that they uh, happen to have two different sets that you can choose from because you can do the sports route okay. if you're into the whole sports ball thing, uh, which I used to be until I hit that puck into a uh, top of the key free throw home run um, and I was asked to leave figure skating. And then there is a pop culture <laughs> pack, which is what we went for. Because I like pop and culture. So, oh, I'm going to hand this You're going to do it this time? <gasps> what is it? What is it? So it looks like we have a little decal. Yep, a decal. And then you've got some literature. It says tradingcardsmonthly.com. We hope you enjoy your latest trading cards monthly box. Share your box on Facebook for a chance to receive five free packs next month. Nice. What else? What else? It's Congratulations! Enough. You've received a bonus card this month. Or right. bonus cards this month. That's pretty so cool. So it's kind of like they're one up. Oh. oh my gosh. What? 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 I think you're going to approve of this what, one. What? What? Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves! with Kevin Costner. Awesome. You gotta go with Christian Slayer. He's hot. Oh, is that your favorite out He's, of that pack? He was my favorite in the whole show. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> yeah. All right. There's well, some good cards, though. All right. Well, the next pack, I believe you will approve of this one, too. Oops. <gasps> Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Heroes in a Half Shell, Turtle Power! Unless you're in the UK, then it's Teenage Mutant Hero Turtles. <laughs> so again, she will open those up and we will show you so a 11 closer upper of what came inside. 11 cards and one sticker. He's been demasked, everybody! Oh, now everyone's going to see this. Teenage mutant man sized turtle walking down the street, you know who he actually is. It kind of looks weird. Mask. Also, real quick, hey, do you guys remember card packs like this? If you ever collected card packs, you would get these. They were pieces that would form yes. the larger image. Used to drive me nuts because you'd get down to needing like only two more and you'd get like five of this one right here. <laughs> and the sticker in this pack is Shredder. All right, next. Dick. Tracy. <laughs> Tracy. 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 You mind if I call you Dick? This one has eight glossy movie cards and one sticker. <laughs> glossy. You know what? I've actually never seen the movie Dick Tracy. No? With Madonna. Was that her first acting? You know, I don't know. I'd have to look it up. Go ahead, future time. So the sticker in this one is the Stooge. Considered armed and dangerous. It's a wanted poster. Oh, and look at the back. It looks oh. like that's another yep. build-a-print. 
And to jump back real quick, the uh, sticker from Robin Hood is the uh, cousin of of uh, the Sheriff of Nottingham, and it does make a thingy on the back, too. Oh, how about... What's next? What's next? Huh. Maverick the movie? Is that the one with uh, uh, Mel, Mel Gibson? Gibson? Fact of the matter is, if I'd have tried to face you down, I mean, what chance would I have had? Absolute zero. None, whatever. I'm curious. Look Break for into randomly in packed seat. tech chrome cards. Chrome. Was that fast? So it is the one with uh, Mr. Mel Gibson himself. Okay, I will admit. And uh, Jodie Foster. I I watched Maverick quite a bit. I well, nice. <laughs> He's busting out the card tricks. I am. So there's Maverick and Jodie Foster. Take it easy there, Gambit. <laughs> <laughs> so so guess, no tech color, tech chrome this time. Uh, I don't know. Would you say that one might be? I don't think no, so. No, I think that's just Yeah, an so I guess shot. we didn't then. There's no sticker in this one. Although it is kind of neat there's a uh, behind the scenes one. So I do remember a lot of times whenever you would get uh, trading cards for movies and sometimes TV shows, I always loved whenever they put those little behind the scenes ones in there because, I mean, of course, it's just fun to see behind the scenes, but back then, like especially yeah, the, the 80s and 90s, it. yeah, you couldn't just pull it up online and see all these images behind the scenes. The other thing that's neat about these cards is um, behind, on the back of each card is a uh, little tidbit about whatever scene you've got going nice. on there. So that's kind of neat. So even though we didn't get the Tech Chrome one, do you guys remember if you collected trading cards, all the weird stuff that they would do? The, the holofoil, you know, the chromium ones. Uh, some would be like embossed. Some Didn't would they have do a lenticular one? signatures. I think they did some lenticulars. Couple. I had some uh, Marvel X Men ones that were really fun because they weren't actually animation cells, but they made them out to be animation cells. So it was just a plastic yeah. card that you could see through, but then it would have like you know Magneto on there. <laughs> All right, what's next? What's next? Ha! Ah! Alf, why don't you open Alf? You, I. I think you probably watched that more than I did. If you're going to the kitchen to get a snack, bring me some. I'll be right back. He wants to eat the kitty cats. Look out, Paul. Uh-oh. <gasps> Hashtag eat the gum. Wait, 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 wait. What year is this? 1987. So the other one was 89, wasn't it? Should we hashtag eat the gum? Ching. We don't have anything to drink. I haven't eaten the gum yet. Oh, it's crunchy. Oh, it tastes so bad. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's so bad. Why would you let me do that? This is a bad idea. This is terrible. <laughs> Hey, guess what? <laughs> We're still alive. That's gross. Nerd, let's take a closer upper look at the ALF cards. So it looks like we got a, uh, a drawing one. Oh. oh, that looks like um, the a Garbage, pail, the garbage kids? pail Kids one. Oh, look, it left a uh, mark from the gum. Oh, gross. We've got a sticker, and it does build a bigger image. Now, this is more of a uh, traditional sticker. You can see the lines uh -huh, yeah, around you can definitely it, so tell it's that's not like sticker. just a uh, full-on, you know, rectangular sticker. I wonder if that would make Russ Lyman's laptop. Do you hey, think, do you think that? What would, do you think, Russ? Is this one worthy? <laughs> and oh, the puns! Karate is all mind over matter. Sure, if you don't mind the pain, it won't matter. <laughs> when it comes to Alf, take it, Millhouse. I got some cool pogs. Elf pogs. Remember Elf? He's back in pog form. All right, there's one pack left. And this is a bit of a super pack. Ha ha! So 10 cards, Ooh. one sticker, and one stick of bubble gum. <laughs> oh no! Hashtag eat the second First of strip. all, how about a closer up row of those cards? Okay, fine. Uh, 
So again, this one does a more traditional outline, letting you know that it's the sticker and then you've got the card thing on the back. And on the back of all the cards, it does kind of give you a little um, information as to what's going on in the picture. Nice. With, uh, he got the movie poster, mm -hmm. it looks like. And from what year? 83. 83. This is the oldest sticker gum I think we've And look at this. Eaten. Look at this. It's, it's all together. This one's a little bit, still a little bit more pliable. You know what love is, nerdlings? <gasps> oh, I don't get to hashtag the old gum. <laughs> How you doing? Not so good. Not so good? <laughs> mm. It's dissolving. Can you see through time? That's not good. You want a drink? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I think that one was the worst one. Are you still alive? Of the gum. The cards are fine. The gum was terrible. Hashtag don't eat the gum. Hashtag it's eat awful. the gum. Uh, no, that piece kind of tasted like you bought some chicken that had already passed the expiration date from the store. And you might have left it in the car for about four hours in the heat. Wow. And then uh, someone ground it up, dried it out into powder, powder and then pressed it down into a chewing gum stick form and gave it to me. Don't eat the gum. All right, nerdlings. That was our trading card monthly box. This was a lot of fun. It was. It was um, a good trip down memory lane. Yeah, I didn't really know what to expect. And honestly, it's, it's always surprising how many things got trading cards. I know, uh, yeah. Things like Turtles and Alf. It's like, oh yeah, you know, of course they did. Uh, Maverick, though? Yeah, that one Maverick I, that was surprised a me. Uh, that doesn't really seem like a movie for kids, so I wouldn't think that that would be their general audience. I've actually seen the Dick Tracy ones in like flea markets and stuff like that, so yes. I knew those existed. But, uh, and it's also very interesting to see how many cards came in certain packs. Yeah. Uh, you know, Superman, we got a nice little yeah, stack we got ten of, of Superman those. here. But these Maverick cards, not a very good stack. Ninja Turtles did really well. And mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure all of them had the sticker uh -huh. and the larger image to right. build, which was very neat. And only two of them had gum. Uh, fortunately. <laughs> so, Nerdlings, I would love to know if any of you collected any trading cards back in the day. Maybe you still do. And what do you think of some of these retro packs? Have you ever seen them out and about while mm -hmm. you've been looking for other things? And if you've seen them, have you ever bought them? Have you ever opened them just to see what's inside? Or do you keep them sealed? Mm -hmm. uh, I always loved collecting trading cards because, of course, I would have the sleeves to put them all in uh -huh. there. You leave the gap for the ones that you're missing. Got them, got them, need them, got them, got them, got them, need them, got them, need them, need them, got them, got them, got them, got them, need them. Yep. And once in a while, if uh, me and some of my friends pooled our money together, we would buy the box. Oh, you know, you'd, you'd buy the yeah, whole box yeah. and you take it home and you guys just sit there and you're like ripping open the cards and you're going through them and you're like, oh, hey, I got cable. Do you have cable? Oh, no, you don't. Well, sweet. <laughs> Here, I'll give you the, I'll give you cable for that Wolverine. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah except nobody wanted collection. Jubilee. Oh, did you guys want Jubilee? <laughs> anyway, again, <laughs> leave those comments down below. Leave the video a like if you happen to like it. Feel free to check out Trading Cards Monthly. We would absolutely love to see what you guys get, what you yeah. guys think. And be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. You never know what's coming in the mail. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for those closer upper pictures to see what we're doing out and about in the real world. And to know when a video is dropped because sometimes YouTube just doesn't tell you that a video is dropped. And head over to Tee Public because we got merchandise over there. And nerdlings, if we like it, we nerd it. <laughs> that is right. Even though we are wearing...
<laughs> Take two. Ready? Yes, sir. All right, nerdling. <clears throat> Damn. <laughs> 